Well, what's going on guys? Today we're gonna learn how to tie a bobber setup for drifting beads for steelhead. We are going to need a leader with a double snell pre-tied up. I have a video that shows how to tie this double snell. If you haven't checked that out already, definitely go and check that out. Two beads. We're gonna need a bobber. We're gonna need a clip swivel with a weight that matches the size of our bobber, a bobber stopper, a bead stopper, soft beads. So let's get started. We're gonna take our line going up to the fishing rod, our main line. So we just simply slide the main line through the plastic sheath of the bobber stopper, push the knot of the bobber stopper up towards the fishing rod, and cinch the bobber stopper knot tight as it goes down. And we just take the plastic piece and we toss that away. I'm going to cinch down our bobber stop as tight as possible. I'm going to trim off the tag ends. We'll slide that bobber stopper up the line just a little bit. I want to put a bead onto the main line. So we're going to take our bobber. We want to make sure that the top of the bobber is going up towards the rod and we're gonna slide our bobber onto our main line. Another bead. We're going to tie on our clip swivel with our weight. We wanna tie this one onto the top of the clip swivel and we will tie the leader to the bottom of the clip swivel. For this, I just use a standard fisherman's knot. I also have a YouTube video of that knot if you wanna check that out. Just double back over, twist a few times, Go through the loop that is inside your finger and go through the loop that you just created and cinch it all tight. Trim off the tag end. The bobber will continue to slide back and forth at whatever depth that we have the, set the, the bobber stopper set to. Then when casted, the bobber will slip all the way to the stopper and fish at your desired depth. Now we want to take our double snell leader. We need to put a bead stop onto it. And we run our line right through the loop on the end of the bead stop and then we pull the bead stop up and over and onto the line. We're going to slide that all the way down until we're only about two finger lengths away from our first hook. We're going to put ourselves on a soft bead. We just slide the soft bead. It has a hole and we just slide it right onto the line, slide it all the way down to our bead stop. We want to kind of push hard on this bead, get it all the way, get the bead stop all the way down inside the bead. Then you've got the bead connected to the double snow. To tie the leader onto the bobber, where we had our clip swivel, we're going to tie the leader onto the bottom of the barrel swivel. We'll just do another fisherman's knot here. We'll twist a few times. We'll go through the loop that our finger is holding and we will go back through the loop that we just created. Cinch everything tight and trim off our tag ends. We've got a bobber stop to a bead to our bobber to another bead to our clip swivel that's holding our weight going out to our leader to a soft bead with a double snelled hook and that's how you tie it. If you guys enjoyed this video definitely make sure to subscribe hit the notification bell to get updated on more videos and check out all my other videos.